Hey everyone, how's it going? Vic with High Desert Man. And uh, it is time to announce the 500 subscriber winners. I, uh, I did the video yesterday of, of picking the winners. And I, I, I realized I had a little bit of a problem <clears throat> when I went to check for my winners. I, I realized that I had a slight problem. I, I wanted people to... Uh, I wanted people to comment cigar only, cigar and beard, or beard and cigar, and or uh, beard only. Uh, but I wasn't ex very clear on that in the directions, especially if you didn't read the description below the video. Uh, but I had a good balance of, of people, and I used a tool called TubeBuddy, uh, that gives me analytics on my subscribers and my videos and all this stuff and one of the features it has is, is a pick a winner feature where you can uh, pick a winner based on comments and it allows you to use keywords which is the only tool I could find I, I did a search online yesterday trying to find additional tools that would let you search based on keywords and none of the other tools I found would let you do that. Uh, the TubeBuddy tool is the only one. However, it, it goes by specific words. So you can either do one word and look for that word, or you can do a, like, essentially a specific phrase. You can't do like cigars plus beard to get any combination of cigars and beards or anything like that. So, so I had to get a little creative in how I did the selection. And I tried to be as fair as I possibly could, guys. So, uh, well, let's uh, first let's talk about the cigar I'm smoking. I'm doing a review right now. This is the this is from Southern Draw Cigars. It's the 300 Hands or 300 Manos, and it's a project done by Southern Draw Cigars to recognize and and give charity to the. Um, uh, to specific Nicara Nicaraguan families that have a part in in making these cigars and stuff. Tradition has it, whatever, that it takes up to 300 hands to produce a single cigar from from planting of the seed up to the last set of hands that touch it, which is me uh, smoking the cigar. And uh, so it's it's a cool project. It's a budget stick, kind of a budget stick. Uh, it it the price range on this is anywhere from I think 549 to 649. Uh, I don't know how many sizes there are, but this is the Churchill. And it's a pretty decent stick. Um, especially at that price range. I, th I think at that price range, it's a really good, really good cigar. But, all right. Let's jump into the draw and see who won. And then I'll come back and we'll talk about... Um, the, you know what people want and stuff so check this out all right everyone it is noon o'clock and it is time to pick our winners for the 500 subscriber giveaway so uh, here's what we're going to do we're going to we're going to pick a cigar only winner first then we're going to do the beard only winner then the beard and cigar winner, and then the last two cigar winners. And I, I have to do this a certain way just because of how uh, how my pick my random pick thing goes. I use this tool called TubeBuddy. I can pick a winner on a specific video, <clears throat> and I can base it on specific words, although I cannot use combinations of words words unless they show up in a specific phrase which kind of sucks so uh, so first we're going to search on cigar only here we go with winner number one <laughs> oh man that is cool Juan the Don Okay, Juan. So you won the you won the smoke chest, bro. That's the first package. And now we are going to do the um, 
the beard only person so uh, let's pick another winner this time we're going to go beard only oh very cool Leo Sigmund so Leo won the beard only package um, that's very cool because Leo has been uh, has been following me for quite a long time he's always kind of been in the background but um, but yeah that's very cool uh, okay now uh, scar only beard only now we'll do a uh, now we'll do a let's see how am I gonna do this now I'm gonna do it just based on beard but I'm looking for someone who mentioned beard and cigars Trent Armstrong, Love Conant, uh, Platt on the Highways Lifestyle. I am a beard and a cigar guy. Okay, very cool. So Trent, you are going to win the um, you are going to win the package that included the cigar prop uh, caddy, the the Camacho caddy box uh, with cigars and and a um, a uh, high desert man. High Desert Man uh, beard care sampler and some soaps and stuff. So let's see, Leo and then uh, Trent Armstrong. Sorry, guys, got to write this down. Okay, now we are just doing cigar only. And guys, the even though this uses uh, c contains words, uses keywords, they don't allow you to filter based on different keywords. In other words, I can't put beard comma cigar or beard and cigar or anything like that whatever I put on in that field it has to show up exactly like that which is a, a kind of a bummer cigar okay on this one I'm gonna do cigar only just to give one of the cigar only guys a chance let's see that's one two three this is our fourth one Jerry Payton. Jerry Payton. Okay, Jerry Payton. You're going to win one of the um, uh, one of the packs that included a crowned heads sampler kit, and I've got one more of those. So now we'll just go. All right, this can be a. a beard and cigar or just a, a cigar person Jim Wilcox Jim Wilcox alright buddy you won the other crown head sampler package alright guys so there you have it there are the winners so let's uh, let's talk about this again um, so the way I did my my search, if you didn't catch it or pay attention in in that clip, was I initially uh, just did a search on on cigar only, uh, then beard only, beard and cigar, cigar only, and then the last one was just cigar. Uh, and the idea behind that was that if somebody had put beard and cigar or cigar and beard or just cigar, then uh, that would have given a cigar only and or a cigar and beard person uh, another chance so I, I, I tried to make it as even and and um, you know as uh, fair as possible so the winners Don Juan the Don from the Don reviews he's a Phoenix boy and I'm I'm actually really excited uh, that that he won because it, he's essentially a homeboy I, I can go down and visit him I have to travel this next week and so I'm going to take his package down and we're going to have a cigar and do some video, do a little bit of collaboration together and I'll present his gift to him and we'll smoke a cool cigar and, and do a little bit of a collaborative review. So I'm, I'm very excited about that. So Don, or Juan the Don, won uh, the High Desert Man smoke chest and the 
uh, crown heads, Las Calaveras hat, and some cigars and, and whatever. Um, then the second person was the beard only. That was Leo Sigmund. Leo Sigmund, if I remember correctly, Leo, you are the guy that would always purchase the, um, when we had our hog fat blend, the natural, which was unscented, I think you were the guy that always bought that and, and uh, always requested that. Um, Leo's been around for a long time. He's, he's commented on a few of my beard uh, videos. Uh, I guess he used to be a pipe smoker or something, but uh, doesn't anymore. But Leo has been around since the early days of High Desert Man, so I, it was really cool to see him uh, win something. Next was Trent Armstrong. He won the cigar prop uh, caddy uh, with the beard sampler, a uh, beard care sampler in it, and uh, cigars and stuff. Uh, next was Jerry Payton. He won a Crown Head sampler, one of the Crown Head samplers, and then last was Jim Wilcox. He won a crown head sampler as well. So, to everyone who participated, thank you so much. I did have, I wasn't able to weed the people out like I would have preferred to, but I did have a lot of people who I could not confirm that they subscribed to my channel. And for all intents and purposes, they came on, they jumped on only for the contest. I, I really, I, I think it takes a special type of person to, to uh, uh, look online for contests and come in just to try and win some free stuff. Uh, you know, the whole idea behind this video, behind the giveaway really, was to try to give something back to the people that have been supporting me. Obviously to pick up some new uh, subscribers and some new support and stuff, but um, you know, guys, it's all about it's it's all about sort of a, a, a give and take relationship, right? <clears throat> um, I, High Desert Man is is a business that I'm trying to build. I'm trying to uh, get more followers and, and more recognition, more word of mouth out there and stuff. And I was very very fortunate to be given some very cool prizes from Crown Heads, from Fox Cigars, from Cigar Prop, uh, from Kevin. Uh, it, it was just really, really cool that I could do something like that for a 500 sub giveaway because really that's a small, a small following compared to like Cigar Obsession or even Kevin. Kevin's up almost at 1,500 followers now. Actually, I think he's at 1,600. Anyways, uh, so I'm rather a small fish in a big pond, but I do appreciate everyone who uh, commented, everyone who has uh, jumped on board. And so here's what you need to do uh, for your prizes. And here's the one thing that I ask uh, from everyone. So to get your information to me, uh, just hit me up at info at highdesertman.com. That is our, our company uh, email address. Uh, and in the, in the subject line, just put... Uh, 500 sub winner or 500 subscriber winner, something to that effect. Um, that way it'll be easy for me to go through my email, filter on those. Send me your mailing address and, uh, and I'll get the packages out this week to everybody. And the only thing that I ask guys is if you are on social media, be it Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, whatever you're on, it would be a huge help to me if you would uh, post pictures of your stuff, post pictures of your stuff in use, especially like with the cigar caddy, uh, the cigar prop caddy, or the uh, smoke chest, High Desert Man smoke chest, and tag those things. At the very least, tag them with hashtag High Desert Man, all one word. Uh, with the smoke chest, you can also use hashtag smoke chest. And guys, it, it just, you cannot believe how much of a help it is it just getting me in front of a few more people to uh, build the channel up more and and uh, build High Desert Man up some more and stuff. It, and it's a very small thing, really, when you think about it. So I, um, I really appreciate everyone doing that. Uh, I want to give a shout out to Martina Maya. 
he's uh, getting close to 500 and he's doing a 500 subscriber giveaway right now too he's trying to hit 500 subscribers on his YouTube channel and 300 followers on his Instagram page I'll put those down in the description uh, Martin does shorter videos than I do typically uh, and and night just really good concise um, cigar reviews from his uh, Mazda car <laughs> most of the time go check out the cigar prop channel if uh, if you don't know about that everyone who watches me I think knows about Kevin but um, Kevin was was very generous and not just with me he's been generous with a lot of channels um, <clears throat> Matt over at Carolina Cigar Review um, uh, Caesar at uh, Smoking Lead uh, uh, YouTube channel. Martin, uh, he's helped a number of people out by giving them stuff to do little giveaways and stuff. And and Kevin's just a really generous guy, really cool guy. I love that guy. Happy to call him a friend. You too, Martin. Don't don't feel excluded. Um, I'll give a shout out as well to uh, Bob the Cigar Guy. Uh, I don't talk about Bob enough, but I, but I I sort of lurk on Bob's channels and stuff. But Bob's a great guy. Bob is just uh, um, he's he's really done good. It, it was surprising to see his channel. I, I got on his channel not at the very beginning, but really early, and he just sort of blew up and 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 climbed really quick and. And he and his son are, are trying to do a lot of different stuff. They do a lot of uh, live streams and stuff to try and mix it up. And So go check uh, Bob the Cigar Guy out. Um, who else? Uh, Gerald over at Cigar Artistry. Gerald doesn't uh, show off his artwork uh, too much, but that guy does some amazing stuff. He makes some ashtrays and some nub tools and, and uh, things. Just really, really nice work. He's very talented. And probably, from just an articulation perspective, one of the best reviewers out there. He's just very concise, very articulate. Um, he's not like Kevin or I with a lot of ums and, and fumbling with our words and stuff. Just, uh, I wish I could speak as well as that guy does. And then finally, go check out the Don Reviews, uh, my first winner. And, uh, and be on the lookout for our collaboration when I uh, give his gift to him. All right, guys, I'm going to wrap it up. Until the next time, stay rugged.